Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make mango chutney. So I just bought this mango from uh, Morrison. So let's try mango chutney. Yeah. Yeah. First, you need to skin off the mango. So you need to skin off thoroughly, and then you need to cut into chunks. You can just cut into small pieces, yeah, because we need to cook in the pressure cooker. So I add the mango in the pressure cooker and add some water, enough water to boil. It's, it takes around 10 minutes to cook. At the same time, I just uh, um, arrange the spices, so sugar and uh, chili powder, cumin powder and cardamom stick and cinnamon stick curry leaves salt turmeric powder and lemon juice so these are the uh, spices so you need to add so you can uh, instead of using uh, the essence uh, you can use the rose water yeah so now it, this is already cooked so i'm going to mash this one i mean the mango i'm going to mash the mango and it comes like a smooth paste so after 10 minutes is cooked in the pressure cooker I just mashing uh, I'm mashing the mango now in this time you have to add the sugar sugar is I have taken for three mangoes I have taken three cups of sugar but you need to add your own uh, choice the sugar is you know your choice so you need to just cook it in a medium heat in this mixture we we have mango and also salt and the sugar so, so i'm going to add the salt now yeah so salt also optional you know if you want a little bit more you can add more so it's just it's it has taken around 15 to 20 minutes uh, now i add a turmeric powder and cook it in a medium heat so i use one teaspoon turmeric powder for the three mangoes and also one teaspoon of uh, cumin powder mix it and uh, i'm adding a uh, cardamom stick and the cinnamon stick cardamom a pot and the cinnamon stick and mix it well so for this you know you need to add a uh, one teaspoon of uh, chili powder or maybe half a teaspoon of chili powder and curry leaves so you need to cook in a medium heat when you reach uh, the consistency I mean the the chutney consistency then you add the lemon juice so three tablespoons of lemon juice you need to add so uh, you need to cook for another five minutes so all over it has taken to complete this chutney 25 minutes so our chutney is ready now look at the consistency it is really tasty so this looks like the actual chutney the look at the consistency the consistent consistent is supposed to be like this so i'm going to transfer this one into the another jar but i am waiting for uh, this chutney to cool a bit So I think I'm going to transfer, it's, it's cold down almost, so I'm going to transfer it in the glass jar. And little by little you need to transfer the mango chutney in the glass jar. You can eat this chutney with any rice or any uh, you know, the food. So this is the final touch of the chutney. So look at the consistency. It comes the correct consistency. So why don't you try this one in the home? Uh, so thank you for watching my channel. I'll see you in another clip. Bye now.